Social distance, wear a mask, wash your hands. How about keep your hands out of the bag? An Austin resident says his Uber Eats delivery driver liked his food so much, he ate some of it. Our Charlie Damar live with the story you'll only see on two. Charlie. Brad and Erica, yeah, you can add this to your list of COVID concerns. A 15 piece boneless chicken wing dinner, apparently too tempting for this delivery driver in all of this. It was all caught on camera. His explanation simple. He was hungry. And he's walking along the grass. And then my camera happened to pick him up. There are security cameras all over Richard Jackson's home. Gestured towards my camera in the Austin neighborhood. He was clearly caught digging into my food. The cameras light up. There's even warning signs alerting people to the cameras. He was digging into the bag, you know, uh, sort of chucking the uh, the boneless wings. But that apparently didn't stop this delivery guy. Repeatedly popping them in. From helping himself to Jackson's dinner. This is when I see the, um, the sauce smeared all over the bag. It's missing several pieces of the chicken. Jackson used Uber Eats to order dinner from Buffalo Wild Wings. He says instead of his assigned delivery driver, a man hops out of the passenger side door and almost immediately begins rifling through the bag. It's concerning that he was so um, nonchalant, especially during a, a, a pandemic where we have a highly transmissible disease. A 2019 U.S. food study pulled 500 deliverers. 28% admitted to snagging customers' food. More than half say they've been tempted to do so by the smell. I did challenge him on why he was eating my food. Jackson confronted the driver on the porch, and after a few moments, Jackson says he got an admission and refused to accept the order. He eventually um, uh, admitted to eating my food. He said that, uh, oh, well, I was, I was hungry. Now, Uber did issue a refund. Jackson said he's also upset with the restaurant Buffalo Wild Wings for not putting those tamper proof seals or stickers on his food. Now, based on Uber's own rules and guidelines, it appears that this driver did violate several of them. A representative, a spokesperson for Uber, says that they are looking into this incident. We are live tonight in the loop. Charlie DeMar, CBS 2 News. Brad and Erica. Charlie, thank you.